So hello and welcome to this first look video, first patch, whatever you want to call it. It's not really a first patch jam in terms of that series of videos I do, but it's just a quick look at the prototype, and I should stress prototype, WTF oscillator from Dove Audio. Now WTF isn't WTF as you may be thinking, it's window transform function. And this works by having a front waveform, and we can scan through different waves, have a rear waveform and a width control. Now the rear waveform, I'm just going to do a single split and make sure this rear waveform is set, we'll come to that in a minute. When we use the width control, it will kind of pinch open the waveform in the middle as if we're opening up a pair of shutters or big glass patio doors or something. It's like pulse width modulating open the centre position to the rear waveform. So this is the rear wave now. Closing the doors. So the white trace on the little screen is always the output. The blue trace is this rear wave, so we can see that change even when we can't hear it. And the red line is always the front wave. There's a couple of things we can do with the rear wave that make this a bit more unique. Not that PWMing between waves isn't unique enough in its application, but this can be a DC voltage. And it then just works like a PWM. It splits open this center point. Do that on a square. We get a nice PWM. but we can do that on all of these waves. Well, it's set to that. Let's make this a dual window. And instead of being in the center, it looks at the peaks of this wave. And on these other waves, it's not quite the peak, but it creates two split points as opposed to one in the middle. Now we can do that with other waveforms as well. So instead of opening from the middle, so you've got these two open points. You can invert the rear wave, which is going to sound different. both in dual and in single mode. And there's a third mode for the rear wave as well, and it can be noise. When that's a noise mode, the rear wave control is now the pitch of the noise. From 8-bit crunchy Atari and old school console type noises up to white noise. It's great with a deep wave flabby saw, I'm just adding in a bit of noise in the middle, playing with the pitch of the noise as well. So this like buzzy wasp in a can kind of glitchiness, weirdness, but it works really cool. And I like that under pitch sequences as well. So let's get Voxproctive in. You can hear it just adds this glitch and character. Another thing to note quickly, we've got modulation over everything. Modulation for the front with an input and attenuators, width mod, rear wave mod, FM, coarse tune and fine tune. 
course tune can be an octave switch with a jumper on the back or smooth it's a smooth knob it's not a switch but that jumper allows you to have an octave and you've about an octave of fine tune so it works really well so we're going to get a sequence in have a quick play around that's been an introduction to what i think is a totally new and unique way of working with waveforms the wtf oscillator from dove audio hit like subscribe comment go support me on patreon if you'd like early access to content and bonus content that is exclusive to my patreon supporters and thanks for watching cheers